everyone, Haley Minogue here answering your questions about literally anything. Today, we've seen several protests over the last few months covering all topics, wearing masks, not wearing masks, racial injustices, playing sports, bearing arms, the list continues. Usually, when we cover these protests, the comment sections have a lot of the same questions. The first, how are they allowed to do this when we have to cancel blank? And, and they usually say a concert, the fair, fans at the derby, you get it. Well, the ACLU writes, the right to join fellow citizens in protest or peaceful assembly is critical to a functioning democracy and at the core of the First Amendment. And second, another question we've seen concerns protesting on government property. Since we've seen some of these bigger protests happen in Frankfurt at the Capitol. Well, can anyone protest unchecked on government property? This one's simple, no. The Freedom Forum Institute, a 501c3 public charity whose mission is to foster First Amendment freedom for all rights. The government can limit protests. First of all, violent protests are not allowed and are outlawed everywhere. Peaceably to assemble is key here, peaceably. Second, not all government property is the same for First Amendment purposes. First Amendment rights apply mostly in traditional public forums like a public park. The website adds, the general rule is that government officials may not impose content-based restrictions on speech in a public forum. This means that city officials must not treat different persons and groups of persons differently on the basis of the content and viewpoint of their messages. Thanks for the questions and keep them coming. Text me what you want to know to 502-582-7290. You might see me answer your question right here on WHAS 11 News.